What up YouTube, this is Mario305151 Today I'm going to show you how to get custom Karyo logos on your iPhone, iPhone 3G, iPod Touch 1st and 2nd generation uh, Today I'm going to be using the iPhone 3G firmware 2.2.1 So let's get to it What you're going to want to do is open Cydia As you see I already have it open You're going to want to open Cydia and once everything loads up, you're going to want to click on search. Click on the uh, search bar. Then you're going to want to write down, make it mine. So, M-A-K-E. And for those who don't understand me, I'm going to have it on the right, to the, on the description. So, make Oh, sorry guys. Give me just one second. Make it mine. Once you write down make it, that's it. It's already, it should already show up. So what you're going to want to do is click on it. And since I already have it, it already says modify on the top. But for you guys, it's going to be install. Uh, what you're going to want to do is click install and then click confirm on the upper right hand corner and once it's done you're gonna wanna return to city and then click home and when you get home you're gonna wanna find wherever wherever it shows up on your on your phone you wanna click on the app let that load up alright you're gonna wanna click here on the white bar and you're gonna write your name, your your alias, whatever it is that you guys want. For me, I'm going to write Mario, so M-A-R-I-O. And when you're done writing your, your desired name or whatever it is that you want to write, you click on Done. And to the upper left-hand corner, you're going to want to click Carrier, this little box right here. Once you click carrier, it automatically changes from the AT&T logo. Let me see if I can get that. From the AT&T logo to your desired name. As for me, it's Mario for my name. So, yeah, once you're done, you just click the home button and enjoy your, your carrier logo. And for those who wants to erase it and have the carrier logo back to the AT&T what you do you go to the app you let it load up you click on the white uh, white bar and just give it a couple backspaces just to be sure click on done and click on the carrier and it will not delete and change back to the to the mar uh, it will not delete the your carrier logo that you made and it will not put it back to AT&T until you hit the home button once you hit the home button it automatically goes back to the AT&T so there you go guys this is the this is my first video hope you guys like it rate comment and subscribe um, this is Mario305151 signing out peace